Hi, my name is Jin. I am MC for dance events and uh, I'm a locking dancer as well. I hold quite a number of jobs just trying to hustle. I started MCing probably during the year 2011 for Get Down Volume 2. It was my good friend KS uh, who asked me to MC. I didn't know why, probably because I'm probably the loud one in the group every time. But I just took up the job and I just MC for it and I guess watching a lot of Taiwanese variety shows in the past helped me a lot so yeah it was it was pretty natural to me lah <laughs> now my inspiration for MCing is probably the Taiwanese variety shows I'm very interested in the whole music scene in in USA the hip hop and rap scene I watch a lot of uh, interviews and I like movies and I'm, I, I guess that all helps a little I get most of my inspiration from the hype men from rap shows I guess to me being an MC is probably able to follow the schedule because most dance events in Singapore they probably need to return the venue on time so timing is very important for that to make sure that the crowd is entertained every time uh, I'm still working on that but because there are some technical faults that will happen here and there and sometimes it's just uh, you can't avoid that and being an MC you really gotta keep the crowd a little bit more attentive to what's happening on the dance floor and also to respond to certain situations in the event such as Maybe people hitting the music, saying the right things at the right time. For me, the most difficult part of being an MC is probably being able to respond to sudden situations such as a uh, shortage of time. So we suddenly have to probably cut the battles to 40 seconds, 50 seconds for one minute. It happens often. Sometimes uh, you need to fill up some time because the judges are in the toilet, you know. So you have to you have to keep the audience entertained. What really stood out in my MCing journey throughout these few years was probably two events. RM Jam has always been a big inspiration to me. And it, it's really a very big event that features a lot of dancers and shout out to Felix <laughs> and uh, RF to have me and Tyron uh, to MC at such a big event for all our championships. They happened back in uh, 2014. Yeah, that's where I really met a lot of good friends and we still keep in contact until now so I think that really impacted me a lot there was a special segment where I kind of uh, performed with uh, Malik and oh man that was there's some crazy shit that went down so yeah my advice for aspiring MCs would probably be not to be shy and also just be yourself because if everybody follows a template then we don't need so many MCs you know everybody got their own strength and weaknesses and I think really it's just to stick to your own style of MC. Probably the best part of the being an MC, people can't recognize who you are because you're always talking and it's easier to talk to people. It gives me a lot of opportunities to know a lot of different dancers from different countries and I would say being a pure dancer is sometimes a little bit hard to do that because Exposure is a little bit more different. I would consider myself lucky to be able to MC. Uh, some things that I would like to say to the future me, let me thankful of the opportunities you have been given. Be humble and don't lose your head. Even if you are already there, always keep working hard and to inspire people. And that's what I tell myself every day and I hope I will stick to it when, when the future comes.